Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got multi-chrome dots and negative space. I've started off with Revlon's Blackout and I'm just going to, this is one of my favorite black polishes. Um, Sister Chic sent this to me and it's, it's a favorite. I don't think they make it anymore but if you ever spot it anywhere grab it because it's a really good one. Um, real nice formula dries down smooth it's not too thick on the nail but it's very opaque could be a one coater depending on how you apply it <clears throat> so there we go we've got our first coat down I'm gonna be using these I love nail polishes ILMP and this is Befringence and next we have Nostalgia and I'm just gonna do kind of like a dry brush not real dry brush but you know I'm not painting the whole nail with each color I'm just kind of dabbing that stuff on just willy-nilly all over the place they're gonna blend a little bit they're gonna lay on top of each other it's just gonna be a free-for-all and I'm just showing you on one nail cuz you know I didn't want this one to be too long cuz there's there's some fun stuff coming up on this one I saw this idea on Instagram but they actually used um, just chrome powders they painted their nails put on chrome powder and then did this technique but I decided I was just gonna do it with regular old nail polish here you just kind of want to cover up all that black with some sort of color and you'll see why here we go I'm gonna top it off with some pro FX quick dry top coat to get it to dry down really well I'm really excited to share this by the way, I didn't come up with this. Like I said, I saw it on Instagram. I'll be using this Model 1's gel top coat. I put a little, piece, little bit out on a piece of tape. And I'm going to be dotting that gel with a dotting tool just willy-nilly all over the nail. Just trying to get it all over the place. But I saw this idea on Instagram, if I can get my thoughts together. And it was something by What's Up Nails. And I saw it and I thought, hmm, that looks interesting. So I decided to give it a try. Now my outcome does not turn out perfectly. Some of my dots kind of bleed together, so they're not perfect. But I just could not not share this. So I'm going to cure this under the lamp. And now I'm going to go in with non-acetone remover. Because I want to leave the gel dots on there. But I want to remove everything around it it's like magic I love this and I will be revisiting this look because I was really into it I just have this is some of that fun that I like to have you know finding different things and doing something totally different but it's cool it's just cool 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 because you, by using the non acetone remover you know it doesn't affect the gel polish at all it just removes all the other polish I'm telling y'all, I just, I just had so much fun with this. And if it had been perfect and not run dots together, I'm telling y'all, I'd probably still be wearing this. I really was digging it. I just thought that was just so cool looking. And I am showing you me removing it off of all the fingernails, um, all that extra polish. Um, you could get in there with a little brush if you felt like you need to and you know you don't have to stop at just dots you could do lines you could do zigzags all kind of possibilities with this I'm just telling you I, I, y'all gonna see this again on my channel because I was really having a good time with it I just thought it was so neat and just ugh, I don't know maybe it's just me I don't know you guys let me know what you think now, of course, you know, I couldn't just leave it like this because, you know, I'm a ninny. So I'm going to put some Northern Lights on it. I've shook my bottle up really good, just like the cap tells you to. And I'm going to add a little bit of Northern Lights to these. I mean, come on, hollow and duochrome, multi-chrome. That's what I'm saying. I'm just, I just loved it. I had a good time. And you can see all those different colors picking up. Is it purple? Is it red? Is it orange? Is it blue? Is it green? It's like, oh, just really, really digging it. Hi, Woody. How you doing? What do you think? I don't think he has an opinion. And now I'm going to top it off with some Posh Top Coat. 
because, you know, I do need some, that's part of the reason why I wear polish is to, you know, give my nails a little bit of strength and, you know, to protect them. That's why I keep polish on always. That and I like looking at it. But here we go with that nice layer of top coat. There you go. That is my manicure. <laughs> that is it. And I've got lots of swatch photos because they're, you know, looking at it in different light, it picks up different colors. So I was trying to, you know, give y'all, you know, a good view of all of that. So let me know what you think about this. Let me a comment down below. Thanks for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.